pozdrav svima i dobro mi došli u novi video na kanalu i u današnjem videu nastavljamo sa novom epizodom Tell Me Why. U slučaju ste propustili prethodno imate dole u opisu videa playlistu sa svim epizodima, pa ako hoćete to da gledate imate i to. I to je to da vidimo sa što treba da radimo. Došli smo... Došli smo ovdje u političku stanicu da pričamo sa Edije. Kaže, ne bi trebalo da ga uznemirava. Uncle's in there. He's really like probably no more snooping. Uncle's in there. He's really letting that guy have it. No more snooping. Dobro. What are you working on? Chief pulled over a truck for... Okay, how did you not immediately scarf this down? You kidding? This is my third helping. I'm so sorry to keep you waiting, Allie, but I really need to finish this before I can break. No worries. I'm not in a rush. Morning. Hola, Miss Ronan. Hey, Gregs. Hey, Allison. What bring... Ooh, these look like wild berries. Mrs. Romero must have frozen them over the summer. Oh, yes, she takes her cooking seriously. Very seriously. Dobro, na kojoj foru ja sada, aha, mogu sad ne mogu vjerojatno da čekam da se završi sve. Šta je ovo? Novine u novinama, ništa posebno, dobro. Šta je ovo? Two all officers, please maintain. Dobro. Dobro, to je ovo zato što smo mi bili upali. I really can't go until I drop my paperwork off with Eddie. Uncle's in there. He's really letting that guy have it. I should probably drop the paperwork here. Eddie's gonna be busy for a while. Top. Dobro. To smo završili. I wonder how Uncle's feeling about me moving away. We haven't really talked about it. Yeah. What's that? Sad? We uh, have new rules about civilians hanging around certain parts of the station. Reception booth is out of bounds. Sorry. I šta ja da radim sad dok ona ne završi? To što treba da radi. God, I hope no one got hurt. Evo je šeraj. I love the smell of this soap. I to bi bilo to što bi ja mogo da vidim ovde. Ja mislim da ja više ovde ništa drugo ne mogu da nađem. Ne mi baš najjasnije što treba da radim. Čovjek moj možda mogao pričati s ovim. Hey Gregs. Going around in circles? Nothing really. Just waiting for D. Then pull up a chair. Dessert for lunch. Pretty cool, right? Uh, pretty cool. Yeah. I've always had a sweet tooth. Got it from my mom. She baked darn near every day. Need to start being a little careful, though. Doctor's orders. Brenda may be in for it, too. <laughs> God, that kid can eat. Linda's pretty concerned, but, uh, growing boys, right? 
He needs the extra energy. He wants to let her in. You are not kidding about the cobbler. This may be her best batch ever. Right? What are you having? Trout pie and, uh, black radish. I'm on a diet. A cobbler diet? Hey, shh, 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 shh. I won't tell if you won't. <laughs> what you reading? Oh, uh, about that dock strike and the trouble these folks are causing for everyone else. Ugh, I hate strikes. What is this, Paris, France? Come on! It's the only way most people have to get anyone to listen. Hey, Gregs. Um, so I'll leave him there. No, I'm fine. So, what's the criminal underbelly of Delos Crossing been up to lately? Eh, poachers, vandalism, a few memorable cases of public indecency. Nothing too serious, which is fine by me. Boring is good. I don't like Juno. My daughter's always begging to move there, but that is not happening. Why? Juno's awesome. There's, like, actual things to do there. Drugs, that's why. Property crimes double the national average. People coming in all the time from God knows where. Oh, I didn't know that. Hey, Gregs. Uh, vacation plan. Got any big vacation plans coming up? Yeah, we'll probably go up to Anchorage for Thanksgiving. Linda's sister lives up that way. But I'm also secretly planning a family trip to New York City for New Year's. Been saving for two years, and I got it all arranged under a fake email. That's really cool. I'd love to go there someday. And it's probably our last big trip before Lauren's off to college, so I wanted to make it count. I'm sure everyone will have a great time. Toto, <sighs> demo. Hey, sorry I kept you waiting. No worries. You'll never believe it. We caught the mailbox bandit. And guess who it was? Wait, huh? You know, the perp who's been going around stealing people's mail and dumping their packages into the snow. Anyway, Dr. Torres caught him. She's got him locked in a cage in the back of her SUV. Wait, she's got him where now? It's a raccoon. Delos Crossing's most wanted turned out to be some trash panda stowaway. <laughs> And this is how legends begin. Anyway, hun, I'm so sorry to bail, but I gotta run this little guy to animal control now. Probably best I take a rain check. Oh, it's it's okay. Totally, I understand. Duty calls. Thanks. Well, we need to try again soon. I feel so bad about missing your birthday. I thought about making you something, but I was a little strapped for time, so... No, I get it. With your brother back, I see where your priorities are now. What? No, no, it, it's not... Relax, I'm just kidding. Hmm. I really gotta go now. Toto. Right, I'll call you later. And try to get some sleep, alright? See ya. Well, there go my lunch plans. Hey, your brother didn't tag along today? No. He didn't really want to show his face around here after the mess he made yesterday, huh? What do you mean? None of your business. Sorry about that. Sorry about that. Yeah, I'm sorry about that. It got kind of out of hand. Don't worry. We know it wasn't your idea, but... Look, we're all worried about you. This isn't the Allison we know. The Allison you know? Yeah. The sweet, smart girl who'd never hurt anyone on purpose. I know you two and the chief made peace, but I gotta say, it ate at him all day. We did what we had to, to get what we needed. All right, I just want you to be careful. I've been doing this for a long time, and people, they mostly don't change, even when we really want them to. Look, I'm really tired. Can we not do this? Allison, I like you. I really do. I've known you since you were a kid. You're honest, stable. You're not a troublemaker. But Tyler, I mean, if he goes down, don't let him take you with him, okay? I, I can't. 
I can't do this. Oh, you okay? Please just let me go. I need air. I need some air. Not but bunny can I Ty? Are you there? Tyler? Answer me, please. Why is he ghosting me? God, I can't breathe. Please stop. Okay, okay. I've been here before. This will pass. I just need to breathe in and out. Hollow the circles. <laughs> Just a little longer. No more time to travel your stream. You're getting there, Allison. You're getting there. I'm okay. I'm okay. What's happening? Are you okay? Yes. Are you fibbing? I'm scared. I don't know what these people are gonna be like. Or when I'm gonna see you again. We can still undo it. We can tell them what really happened. No way. It's done. That's it. You're gonna be there to talk on the voice if I need you, right? Of course. It'll almost be like we're still together. It's time to get going now. Come on. Wait, Chief. Just a sec. Hey, uh, kids. I, um, I went back to the house and got a few things for you. I, I know how much he's meant to you. Thank you. Thank you, Sam. Oh, kids, I... This is just goodbye till next time, okay? <laughs> Allison? What are you doing out here? It's freezing. I just needed some air. What happened? What's wrong, little moose? I think I had a panic attack. Well, I'm going to do some yarding. It's going to be okay. Let's get you inside and warmed up. Then we can talk about what happened. I'm sorry. This morning has just been so... God, I'm embarrassed. Don't be. You haven't had an attack in a while. What's going on? I've just been so wrong. About everything. 
Did Tyler say something to make you feel that way? No. It wasn't him. It was me. I failed him. Over and over. From here, it looks like you've been busting your ass to help him. You don't understand. Allie, you've got so much weight on your shoulders. With Tyler coming back, and your big move, you know, maybe it's time to ease off some of this, some of this other stuff that's clearly stressing you out. If you mean Marianne, I can't. I owe it to Tyler to see it through. Do you? I don't know why you've always blamed yourself for that. It wasn't your fault. That's not true, Uncle. I was there. I... You were 11 years old. There was nothing you could do. You can't go on letting it haunt your every waking moment. <sighs> Look, you're not your mother, okay? What do you mean? I mean, something happened to her. Something bad. I don't know what it was, but... I never left her. You can't make that same mistake. You gotta tell those ghosts to move on. Sad ovdje mu priznamo ili... Možda ako priznam bit će lakše. Uncle... It was me. I... is the one who... had the scissors. What? What are you saying? She... She was threatening Tyler. So I stabbed her. I... I killed her. I killed my mother. <laughs> but Tyler confessed. He he went to fireweed. We lied. We lied to everyone. Nada. <laughs> How? How could you let him take the blame? It was a mistake, I know. But we were in shock. Tyler wanted to take the blame. And I let him. But we should have told the truth. It must have really hurt. Keeping that inside all these years. I pretty much just bottled it up. And now it's all I can think about. Everywhere I look. She's there. I can't take it anymore. <laughs> it's not easy to admit something like that. It takes a lot of courage, Allison. <laughs> no, I should have seen it. So sorry. None of this was fair to you two.
Thank you, Uncle. How are you feeling now? Any better? Relieved, actually. And really tired. Uh, I was remembering something earlier. I don't know if it even really happened. The day Tyler left for Fireweed. Did Sam come by with some of our stuff? Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. He did. He brought our goblins. How close was he with Mary Ann? I remember he brought us our goblin figurines. And we had a big group hug? Yeah. He borrowed the house keys so he can go out and get them. He was over at our house a lot. Fixing things, chasing off animals. I know you didn't turn up anything about who our biological father was. But did you ever think it might have been Sam? Oof. Well, your mom and him were close, so that's a possibility, but I never found any proof, no. I should go talk to him. Are you sure that's a good idea? You need to get some rest. I have to do this. And not just for Tyler. For me, too. I love you, Uncle. Thank you for everything. I'll call you later. Nađemo Sema prvo ovdje. Šta? Out of order go around. Good. He's here. Top. Dobro. Šta je bilo? Ай, добро, тварай врат. Ай, Сэм. Ты окей? Да, я нормально. Что ты делаешь? Ах, мой кузен Билли купил новый мотор-бот, но этот фул взял инженер, взял ее вот. Да, я сказал ему, что я сделаю это. Can't put any of the chain or the valve covers back on. So, uh, did you need something? Just checking on you. I wanted to talk. I wanted to talk. I was hoping to. Uh, I actually wanted to check out your boat. Is all. Uh, yeah. Well, all right. Uh, here she is. Not sure. Need some. Need to put the board in. I haven't seen your boat in the water for a while. Uh, yeah, it was time for annual haul. No bananas on board? Really? Damn right. It's not just superstition. This one time, this greenhorn... So, um, I was over at the station, and I was thinking about some things. Yeah? You've known us for a while. Your whole lives. You puked all over my slick denim button-up. That's a nice memory. Are you gonna be long? I was hoping we could talk. I don't need my ears to fix an engine. What's up? I, uh... Never mind. Uh... Where's your brother? 
Uh, we had a fight back at the house. We. Back at the house. Back at the house, I guess. <clears throat> so, uh, what's he getting up to today? Who knows? <laughs> All right. This article about ocean acidification is really unnerving. What's that? Oh, um, there's an article in today's paper about how climate change is ruining the ocean. Mm. Yeah. Hey, an encyclopedia of astronomy. I have this one. Impressive collection. Hey, you want some? Take them. I don't really know. Whoa, that's a really nice sextant. Well, it sure is. It's a present from my old crew for my 30th birthday. It's beautiful. <laughs> well, it, it's mostly just for decoration these days, but uh, I'm a big fan of doing things the old-fashioned way, you know? How's the, uh, how's the house coming along? Slow. Physically painful. Slow. Slow. There's... A lot to do. Of course. I mean, <laughs> there's a whole life, uh, lives in there. No shame. Dobro. Šta još možemo mi ovdje da vidimo? Šta zna se ako se popnem gore? Having some trouble? Can't get these nuts loose because my idiot cousin let them rust. I got a can of rust remover somewhere. Come across it, pass it over, yeah? Oh, uh, sure. Still can't get them off? <laughs> nope. Uh, this is driving me up the goddamn wall. Uh, if I could only find that goddamn rust spray. Rust spray, dobro. Sad ćemo mi nemo nađemo taj spray. Uh, elk. Would this help? Oh, uh, thanks, princess, but that ain't it. It's, uh, it's in a red can. Not a princess. A red can. Znači, nama treba spray u crvenoj konzervi. Open. Kako? Could you check if I have rust spray somewhere in this mess? Hello, what are you doing? Good. Now let's see. Should be just about. Pass me that wrench, will ya? Sam? Are you our father? <sighs> Figured you'd ask me that question someday. Well? I wish I was. What the hell kind of answer is that? I'm sorry, Ellie. But the man you're looking for... He ain't me. Yeah. 
down. Oh, okay. Guess I'll just take your word for it then. Hey, you got no right coming in here, getting angry at me for something I got nothing to do with. Stop lying. But you were so close. You two were so close. I know you meant something to her. You honestly think I would have let you two grow up without a father? I may be a deadbeat, but I'm no coward. But you must know something. I truly don't. Your mama, she never... Look, we were just friends. I mean, take a look at old Sam. No woman like Marianne would ever think twice about a guy like me. I'm so sick of this. I'm so tired of trying to unravel all of Marianne's fucking secrets. I don't... I don't understand her. I want to hate her so much. But I don't even know who she was. Come with me. I want to show you something. Hopla. Come in, come in. Oh, when was the last time you cracked a window? <laughs> He's on the fritz. Oh. Come over here, sit with me. What's all this? Here, I uh, kept a few things. I remember this. We got this on our trip to Juno. Uh-huh. <laughs> she saved up for a whole year to make that happen. Oh, dear Sam. Uh, Sam Kronski. Dobro, sorry, njemu slali. Pismo, dobro. Mother made that. Oh, she was a real artist, that one. Kind of like you. Swords and schemes. Oh, and I took her to see that for her birthday. <laughs> she hated every second of it. Whole drive back, she talked about how it butchered the books. Did you like it? I, uh, well. <laughs> Fell asleep before I even saw a sword. <laughs> Dear Sam, and uh, twenty to twenty-five. So congratulations on making it uh, to twenty-nine. I certainly wouldn't have uh, survived long out. I hear without you, so thanks again for everything you do. Laura is a very lucky woman. Marianne, dobro. I šta on drži rukao? Look at these ones. She looks happy. Hmm. She was. When was this? Why are you wearing a square hat? Oh, yeah, that was when I finally got my captain's license. <laughs> Mary Ann's the one who pushed me to get it. Made me wear that stupid hat when I went to take the oath. Huh. Yeah, Laura took this one. We'd been working on that barn for months. That roof was a son of a bitch to sheath. Rain just kept on leaking into the loft. Wait, the barn has a loft? 
Oh, yeah. You didn't know? No, she didn't tell us. Is that a trap door? Yeah. Jimmy closed the whole thing up. Told her it was gonna be real hard to get any hay up there, but she said she didn't mind. Do you know what's up there? I could tell she didn't want to talk about it, so I respected that. Well, we're gonna have to empty it out for the sale, so I guess we'll know soon enough. Well, are you really gonna go through with this? It's like I told you, that, that house meant everything to your mama. It's it's all I it's all we got left. You can't just throw it away. I know how hard this has been on you. But you need to move on. What's done is done. Maybe it would help to talk to someone about it? I never tell you about the time I broke my leg. Shin bone snapped in three different places. Stuck in my ass for a month. No use to anybody. I was so down, I couldn't even bring myself to get out of bed. But your mama, uh, she doesn't have none of that. She got me up one morning and drove me to a nice spot by the harbor. We watched the boats come in and out one morning. You can't let yourself be defined by the parts that are broken. That's what you told me. You gotta find a way to work with what you got. I think... I think about that... a lot. <laughs> gotta... remember. Zaspa batica opet, ima opasno zajevanu naviku da zaspi u sred razgovora. Zato što je stalno pijan. Hey, Tyler. I've been looking all over the place for you. Are you all right? Yeah, I'm fine. Whoa, whoa. Hey, let's get you off your feet, okay? Listen, if you want to be alone, I'll go. But if there's anything you need to get off your chest, I won't snitch. You saw Allison? How is she? Yeah. I, I went back to check on her this morning. She was in a pretty bad way. Whatever went on between you two, it, it wrecked her. Look, I don't want to drag you into this. Well, I'm already in it, and you look like hell, so... I just got a lot on my mind. Well, I know one thing that's good for that. 
As a wise man once said, fishing is the cure to the wounds of the heart. I don't know if I'm in the mood. No way. After all that talk, you're not backing down on me, are you? I, I don't know. Come on, we're burning daylight. Let's go. Where are we gonna go? Why go anywhere when we have a perfectly frozen lake right here? Ice fishing in November? Yeah. It got cold way fast this year. Climate change. That shit's gonna kill us. But hey. Fish first. You can walk behind me if you're afraid, though. You're actually serious. I am a very serious man, Tyler. Let's go. We still have to get everything out of the car. Stage is set. It's showtime. Whenever you're ready. You sure you don't want to go? Nah. Look, no way I'm going to rob you of your first catch in your own backyard. <laughs> All right. Got everything you need, by the way? Yeah, I'm good. Man, I'm so going to miss this. Miss what? Just hanging out and fishing and, you know, I'm not going to have a lot of time after you move to Juno with school and the JC and everything. Right, right. So did any of the people you came up with at Fireweed land in Juno? Oh, uh, I'm not sure. Once they left, I never really kept in touch. Really? No, we were, we were not that close. Everyone moves on. Everyone moves on. People came and went a lot. And besides, everyone moves on eventually, right? <laughs> not everyone. Not people who get so close, they're like family. I already have a family. Well, there's a reason we think of families as trees. They keep on sprouting new branches. And... Oh, uh, hey, I think I've got a bite. You got this. Reel him in. Come on, pull up on the rod. Now give it a nice pull. Come on, pull up on the rod. Slippery little. Got it. <laughs> Bravo. First of many. Pace yourself. It's a marathon, not a sprint. <laughs> Thanks, Sensei. Oh, hey, did you want to make solid plans to hit the buzzard hole? The river might ice over soon, so we shouldn't wait too long. Mm. Yeah, sure. Sweet. I was planning to go Saturday. I'll pick you up on the way out. Cool. I'll set my alarm to ass crack of dawn. Hey, so the other day you were talking about your chosen family. How did you find them? Well, high school can be kind of rough when you gotta hide who you are every second of the day. I got to a pretty dark place. I can relate to that. One morning, my uncle woke me up and told me to get into his car. I figured we we're going fishing or something, but then we ended up outside the Juno Coalition for Equality. Your uncle brought you to the JCE? Yep. Yeah. He didn't know how to help, so he found someone who did. That sounds amazing. You know, even if you don't move to Juno, my offer still stands. The JCE holds a monthly meeting. You meet a lot of good people there. I don't know. It sounds like you're good, but I'm not sure I'd fit in. No pressure. Just letting you know the door is open. 
You got anything good in there? Maybe, but who says I'm willing to share? Okay, fine, be that way. All right, here we go. How about them apples? Oh, <laughs> nice job. So, you weren't all talk. Impressed? I only see two fish in my cooler. For now. So, what are you gonna make with what we catch? Hey, you got me figured out. Slice of fresh fish, topped with garlic, pesto, walnuts, just a drop of olive oil. Pure perfection. As my partner in crime, you're entitled to a cut. Okay. Works for me, partner. So, about last night. I don't know what Allison said, but from my side, well, I thought we were on the same page. But it turns out we weren't. Hey, so don't tell her I told you, but last week your sister was almost unbearable. She was jumping up and down with excitement at you coming back. Really? <laughs> you better believe it. Look, the last time you saw each other, you were kids. Just because things have changed doesn't mean you can't work it out. I know. It's probably my fault. I really pushed her last night. I just don't get why she always has to run away from everything. Can you blame her? <sighs> Avoiding the problem doesn't make it go away. She's so fixated on selling the house. It's like she's trying to bury the past. All of it. Even the good parts. Look, I'm not picking sides here. Okay, but she's been murder house girl ever since it happened. Now she's got a chance to put it behind her. And start fresh. <laughs> Shit, I'd be pretty eager too. I didn't really think about it. I was a kid who killed his mom. I guess I didn't really think about that. I've been so focused on my own shit. It's been hard, you know? Figuring out how to live out here. You mean outside of fireweed? Yeah. When I first got there, all I could think about was getting out. It felt like a cage. But after a while, it started to feel more like a shell. I figured out who I was in there. But now I've got to work out how to be that person out here. Well, if it makes you feel any better, none of us really know what we're doing. Look, shit may look bleak now, but your sister's never going to give up on you. And you can lean on me too if you want. Just be careful, okay? Got a bad left shoulder. <laughs> I'll keep it in mind. Thanks for listening. Don't mention it. Don't you say anything. I got I'm so pet I got nothing. That was clean. Huh. I'm a little disappointed. Hey, can I... Can I ask you something that's pretty personal? Sure. Take off the gloves. You, uh... You've been with people, right? Uh, romantically? Uh, yeah. A few. Have you? Uh, no, not really. That's kind of surprising. Well, people say it's about finding your other half. 
but I don't really feel like anything's missing. Which is actually super healthy. I guess the way I see it is it's not about being completed, but having like someone to spend the ride with, you know? Huh. Yeah, I can see that. You want my take on it? Sure. Heartbreak sucks. Look, I stopped listening to the entire indie folk genre just because I was dumped at a show once. But I put myself back out there just like everyone who's ever gotten their heart stomped on. Because when you meet someone who really sees you, you don't have to pretend anymore. It's just... Znaš za što mu kažem, brate, znači opet su me ubacili u mašinu sa ovim, brate, pričama s kojima ja ne volim baš da se bavim i... It's just not for me. Aj, ovo ću. Yeah, it all sounds nice, but it's just not me. A true lone wolf? I can respect that. Hey, you've been dangling that line an awful long time. Sure you didn't forget the bait? Here, watch a master at work. Take it away. Hey, you're missing the show. Whoa, careful now. You look like you might be enjoying yourself. <laughs> it's an act. But seriously, thanks, man. This is exactly what I needed. <sighs> Almost. It's just missing one tiny thing. Ben Chip, you read my mind. You know Allison refuses to eat anything cold in the winter? Sir Loss, from now on you've got someone to call if you want to fish or slam a pint of Ben and Jerry's in the snow. A pint? Uh, small fry. We should try to do this again while I'm still in town. For sure. You have my number now. Hey, Ali. I think I'll just show myself out. Okay. Sorry. Don't be. I'll see you two later. Sorry for interrupting. No, it's totally fine. We were done anyway. Catch anything? Mostly ice, but yeah. Tyler, I'm sorry for freaking out yesterday. All of this... It's just been really hard on me. Don't apologize. I was being an asshole. We should have never pushed you that hard. Come here. Dobre. God, why did I miss you so much? It's only been a day. I've been told I have that effect on people. You dumb dumb. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I need to show you something. What? You're kind of weirding me out. Can we sit down for a sec? So, what is it? I was just at Sam's. He's not our father. How do you know? I asked him, point blank. And you believe him? 
That is just not his style. And you took his word for it? He was crazy in love with Marianne. Whoever set that fire was doing damage control. And Sam's... nothing but damage. I guess he really doesn't have anything left to lose, does he? There's something else. Look at this. This was taken in 1992 when Marianne first moved to Delos Crossing. See that ladder? Sam told me the barn has a loft. He helped her build it. Apparently she never told anyone about it. And it's still there? As far as he knows, yeah. What do you think? Should we give it a shot? We've come this far. And a hidden loft? That's got secret shit written all over it. Let's go. I to bi bilo to što se tiče današnje epizode. Nadam se da ste uživali. Ukoliko jeste, ostavite like, subscribe-te se na kanal kako ne biste propustili neko od narednih epizoda. A mi se vidimo u narednom videu. Pozdrav i ćao.